New developments when it comes to those popular electric scooters we're seeing all over the city. Well, Atlanta police say they are now officially enforcing the city's new scooter ordinance. CBS 46's Rebecca Schramm, she's live in Midtown uh, this morning. And Rebecca, no more leniency in scooter riders are really going to have to get used to this. Yes, they are, Tracy and Karen. Good morning to you. Yeah, for the past 10 months or so, Atlanta police have really given a break to people who ride these scooters. Well, you knew it would happen. The uh, grace period is over. Now, if you violate the city's ordinance when you ride one of these things, you could face a big fat fine. They have already written a couple of tickets, but they're really putting a heavy emphasis right now on handing out flyers because their goal is to educate people. The Atlanta Police Department even released a video on the do's and don'ts of riding scooters. It reminds people not to ride them on the sidewalk. You're supposed to be in a regular traffic lane. You cannot use a cell phone while you ride a scooter and you can't ride with another person. Where you leave them is also important. It's against city ordinance to block sidewalks, crosswalks, doorways, driveways, or parking spaces. Here's what one rider thinks about all this. I think it's great that they want to inform people first because a lot of people don't know the new laws yet. And maybe those laws will help save lives one day, I hope. I don't like tickets personally, but you know, maybe it's, it's for the better. Yeah, and again, the grace period is over. If you violate the city's scooter ordinance, you could face a fine of up to $1,000 and habitual violators could even face jail time. We're live in Midtown, Rebecca Schramm, CBS 46 News. Rebecca